After dealing with the pandemic for the past two years, many people are anxious to take a trip, possibly to a beach in the sunny south. Before you go, make sure you have the proper travel insurance. One family got a shock when they thought they had coverage, but they didn't. Here's Pat Foran and Consumer Alert. Pat. Thanks, Michelle Anzorita. A man from Maple went to Jamaica and thought he had travel coverage through an insurance plan. He stayed there for eight months, and when he had a stroke and had to be airlifted home, the $33,000 flight was not covered. And they did that, and when they went in, they found him lying in the sofa. Frida Burton says her family got quite a scare when her husband Vashni became ill while he was in Jamaica. He arrived there in December of 2020 for a prolonged stay and had a stroke in August of 2021. The couple had an insurance plan which included travel coverage, so they decided to have Vashni flown home by air ambulance. The cost was almost $33,000. I had to pay 32900 on the air ambulance Canadian to bring him back home. Burton was counting on being reimbursed for the flight, but following a review of her case, she was told she wouldn't be. They only cover for the first 30 days. They don't cover because he was in Jamaica for such a long period. They don't cover that. There are some common misconceptions out there, especially with group insurance plans. Martin Firestone with Travel Secure says many group insurance plans offer travel insurance, but they may be capped at 30 days. After that, a person would have to return home, but if they left on another trip, they would again have 30 days of coverage. However, if you're out of the country for more than 30 days, you would need to purchase additional insurance. If you don't do that, you are virtually down there on day 30 or day 31 without coverage, and that's a pretty scary thing, as we all can find out. If there's a claim, it will not get paid. Firestone advises everyone to triple-check insurance coverage before taking a trip. Burton thought she did have insurance and was unaware of the 30-day limit and is still hopeful a portion of the air ambulance bill can be reimbursed. And Firestone says many of his clients are deciding to travel again, and he says many insurance policies do allow for COVID coverage, but plans can have differences and limitations, so make sure you know what's covered and what's not before you go. On your side... I'm Pat Foran.